Good morning, Sparkle Squad. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Jasmine, and welcome to my channel. So, right now, it is actually Wednesday, and we are in the hotel room right now, and we got up. It's around 7 a.m. right now, and I got dressed and everything, but now we're going to go downstairs, and we're going to eat breakfast. So we're back in the hotel room and we finished eating breakfast and while we were at breakfast they had like the TV playing and I was playing the news and they were talking about how there's going to be like a huge storm in Florida. It's not exactly a hurricane but it's just going to be like a lot of rain and wind and stuff like that and it's going to like there's a lot of schools that are closing and there's also like the rink is closing I know that so it's going to be pretty crazy down there but I'm all the way up here so I guess we'll see what happens. Guys, it's so sunny outside and the weather looks like it's so nice because it's like shining and the sun looks so nice and warm and everything, but it's like 30 degrees outside. It's literally freezing, but it looks so pretty at least. <laughs> All right guys, so now you're gonna find out the moment of truth of why I'm here. So now like I'm gonna do a little countdown. So three, two, one, ta-da! <laughs> Alright guys, so as you can see, I am in my skating dress because I'm actually at a competition right now. And as I already told you guys, I'm in Massachusetts, but I'm in Boston, Massachusetts because I'm here for sectionals. I already know that I told you guys that I didn't make it to sectionals, but I got a call last Wednesday that I qualified for sectionals and I had barely any time to get ready because I stopped practicing my programs because I thought I didn't make it. So. It's gonna, it was like a really short time to get ready and it was a last minute decision to come here in last minute notice. But we're here right now and today is short program and I'm competing my short program today and I'm really excited to be here and I'm just gonna try my best and we're gonna see how today goes. <laughs> Thank you. 
feeling alive, nothing in sight, forever in flight. Follow those lines, we'll make it this time. Blurry street lights, work as a guide to memories that we're we'll making tonight. Oh yeah, we'll make it tonight. Yeah. guys so I just finished or my event just finished and I skated trash <laughs> I didn't do like good at all my program wasn't very good um, but I do want to tell you guys one thing so if you guys are getting ready for like a competition or if you guys know that there's like a competition coming up you got to keep training your programs because I just didn't know that I was actually going to make it here because I didn't get like a call or anything saying that I was like an alternate or anything and I didn't think that I was going to make it so I stopped training and then I got the call like a week before the competition started and I had three days to get ready for the competition and that was not enough for me to get ready and get all my programs in shape and stuff like that but it's okay at least now I know that next time even if I'm not like there or something then I'll just keep training until the competition is over just to be safe that I'm not gonna like lose all my programs and do bad <laughs> I knew coming into this competition that there's no way that I was going to like be top four or at, at all that, that I would qualify for nationals and I knew that I wasn't gonna do good because I didn't have a lot of time to prepare for it but the only reason that we did come was for the experience because obviously I've never made it to sectionals before and it's definitely very different than like a normal competition because obviously you're here with some of like the best skaters in your section so it's pretty different but um the ice is also so much nicer here the ice is also really different like if you guys look there's practice ice right now but like there's none of the lines or like any of the curling circles or like hockey circles and stuff like that and the ice is so empty and like i'm just used to like I, at my rink we have like all the lines all the curling circles and stuff like that and I know like where my jumps are supposed to go but without anything on the ice I barely know where I am and this ice is also Olympic size and it's also an arena so there's seatings like all around and I got on the ice my first time and it felt like so huge like I literally feel like a little ant skating on the ice and it's so big 
but it's a good experience and now I know like what I have to look forward to for like next season and stuff like that but I still have Friday so hopefully Friday is going to be a little bit better so now that I'm a little bit more used to like th what it's like this is what the rink looks like and it's absolutely gorgeous oh my gosh I love this rink so much it's so pretty they have a whole, whole jumbotron and everything and it's so cool they have like the performance center over there like it says the sign and then on that wall like that entire wall right there is filled with like old skaters and like old skating pictures and stuff like that hold on let me try and zoom if you guys can see but it, it's it's absolutely like this rink is absolutely beautiful and um it's like so nice i love how they have like the wood right there it like makes it look nice and cozy and it's like so pretty um but yeah the ice is also really really nice like it's super crunchy if you guys can hear like the skates like the blades and stuff like that and it's so nice i love it but it's also really different than what i'm used to so <laughs> I've been dreaming on in my head like I've seen it A life worth living is a life with meaning I'll do what I love till my heart stops beating I'm feeding this demon Got a taste, can't erase bitterness in my face Work a job every day till your dreams fade away Like a card, never change, play the game Now we say, I need a break Time to stay strong, need to move on to be what I want. I'll keep dreaming on. Time to stay strong, need to move on to be what I want. I'll keep dreaming on. Face on when I chase like that, yeah, I play so strong with a knife in the back. I'm a swing home run like a baseball bat. Gonna see me rise if you hate on that. I don't play both sides. Alright guys, so we, we are back in the hotel right now. And today it did not go as I expected. But after I competed and after I talked to you guys, we found out that there was like another practice size, a 20 minute practice size. And I went on and I skated on that one because I wanted to like skate on the ice one more time because like this rink feels completely different than what I'm used to because there's no lines on the ice at all It's like clear ice with like their logo in the center It's a stadium rink So it feels so much bigger because there's seats all around and also the boards like you have the boards But there's no glass over it So I'm not used to that either and the entire place just feels huge and it's so much different skating on it But I did go back on and I worked on like my double axle and my triples and stuff like that And I got them to work which is good um, and I think I'm starting to get more used to the ice so hopefully it's going to be better for the free skate but yeah so now that you guys know where I am I'm at sectionals I compete my free skate on Friday so tomorrow I have a day off from competing and if you guys you guys have to stay tuned though because I have a surprise for you guys tomorrow like another like surprise of what I'm doing tomorrow but you guys have to stay tuned for tomorrow to see what that is and I'm competing my free skate on Friday and I hope that it's going to be a lot better than today <laughs> alright guys I think I'm going to end the video off here because it's almost 8 o'clock at night and I'm pretty tired today was a long day I had practice ice I had skating <laughs> I had competed and I also had another practice ice and it was pretty long but I think that I'm just going to relax for tomorrow and I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. Love you guys. Bye!